Hi, there are four kinds of pause in FS 2020. The application pause that you get when you hit the escape key and bring up the menu system like this. Active pause that you invoke with the pause button on your keyboard. Third is an actual pause for the sim. And the fourth and final one is a developer menu simulation pause. Obviously, the escape pause is no good for taking screenshots unless you want one of the menus. Using active pause is an option, but if you're on autopilot, you'll typically end up with a scenario much like this one after you resume the simulator. The third kind of pause is an actual pause for the sim that pauses everything just as you have it with the exception of traffic and the clock. And unlike active pause, it doesn't have the effect of making the autopilot behave oddly or cause odd stalling behavior. This third pause is, by default, not bound to any keys. Yes, you heard that right. You must manually go in and configure a key binding for this pause in order to use it. So let's do that. From the main menu, go to the options screen. From here, select the Controls screen. Now, and this is important, make sure the filter is set to All. Search for Pause. The first two entries that should appear are Set Pause Off followed by Set Pause On. You can click on the Start Scanning option so the program will scan for whatever key you type. I assign Set Pause Off to Control P. Click on the Validate button to make the application ensure that this assignment doesn't conflict with any others. For Set Pause On, I set this to P and again I hit the Validate button. By default, P and Control P are not assigned in the sim. You can assign this any way that you see fit, obviously. Once that's completed, click Apply and Save at the bottom of the screen and then hit Escape to exit. Now, with this pause turned on, everything is actually paused in the sim with the exception of traffic and the clock. You can still use the drone cam to look around, and you can see by the vehicles still moving on the ground on the streets here that indeed traffic is still moving, and the sun will also be moving with the clock. You can leave and go have dinner or whatever suits your fancy, come back and unpause it, and autopilot will not be going crazy, nor will you be having the random stalls that can occur with the active pause. I really have no idea why a Sobo chose not to bind this pause to a key. If you need to pause everything, including the clock, then use the fourth pause in the dev menu. To activate this, go to the options screen from the main menu, Click on General. At the very bottom on the left side menu is Developer Mode. Turn this on and click Apply and Save. You'll now have a new menu at the upper left of the simulator screen. From here, go to Options and select Pause Simulation. You can also invoke an FPS meter that will remain persistent in the sim as you fly as well if you like. It's a little bit big and obtrusive though. The developer menu pause simulation will pause the clock, but oddly, it does not pause AI traffic on the ground or in the air. None of the pauses in the sim will pause multiplayer or live traffic and weather either, which is expected. So now you have an actual pause for FS 2020 that won't break autopilot. I hope this video helps someone out there. If you didn't like this video, please hit the dislike button, but if it helped you, please hit the like as that lets me know which of these videos are working. That's it for this video, and until the next video, take care.